Welcome to ESPN College Basketball. You're watching the Pac-12 on ESPN. And welcome to the home of the number one team in the country. A sold out McHale Center in Tucson, Arizona. The Wildcats atop the rankings for the first time in a decade as they take on number 23, Wisconsin. And Arizona royalty here, Steve Kerr, Terry Francona, among the celebrities here at McHale. The Badgers looking for their first road win in school history against a number one team. McHale is rocking. They might have the best team in college basketball. They have been through the first month of the season. And Kylan Boswell, the point guard, sophomore from Champaign, Illinois. This is what Wisconsin likes to do, one-on-one -on -one in the post. And Crow able to score over Ballo. At the best of his career. Missed the free throw, offensive rebound, though, by Ballo. Here's Pella Larson, and he throws a three. That is that remarkable? Johnson, great hustle, but then ripped away by Chucky Hepburn. And the guards are going to have to get down there and help the big guys rebound. Storm. Beautiful move, counted and won. Illinois, and Chucky Hepburn does a great job of ripping that ball away from Keyshawn Johnson. And even though Wisconsin does not. Five straight points by Wisconsin and looking to retake the lead here. Three and a half minutes gone by. Boy, what a move by Chucky Hepburn. Reverse layup and he gets the bounce. He can probe and pull up, but he's just got a great sense of fantastic the ball in his hands when he was a freshman over the summer between his high school senior year and his freshman year. And he's been the point guard ever since. Larson's two for two from three. The basket, Pella Larson, the transfer from Utah. He can shoot it, and he hit the first two threes of the game. Could really stretch the floor out for Wisconsin. Wisconsin 0 for two tonight from three inside the basket. Odieu Sakriva sets the, the screen in the middle of the floor. And because Stephen Crowell has to help on the ball, those are plays that Wisconsin has to finish. Love a little out of control, but able to gather and score. And Arizona leads by four. Wisconsin getting all of its points basically from inside the lane. A floater goes down. Tough shot by Max Klesman. Air ball from Blackwell. In an advantage situation, but a great job by Lewis to block this shot. And Pella Keyshaw Johnson in the lane, no look pass, batted right back to him. Shot clock at eight, hoisting a three and hitting is Boswell. Necessary reach. The ball was loose here and Johnson was able to come up with it. That led to the... It's going to be played down in the post and here's Tyler Wall. He wants to get to that left shoulder and go to his right hand. Spins back into Ballo, flips it up and in. He's just got really good footwork. Talk about a guy that does everything. The only thing he doesn't really do is shoot it from the perimeter. Ballo inside gets the basket. Good luck. Got to his right hand on the other side of the basket, and Stephen Crowell got caught up top. Perimeter shot, but a really smart play to get closer to the basket. Good find by Ballo out of the double team, and it's paid off with a three by Jaden Bradley. With a very good double team. But Ballo just turned to the inside. This is a really difficult pass to make to Jaden Bradley but he got all the cutting that Wisconsin is trying to do. And one and done for Wisconsin after the miss by Klesmet. Arizona ball with a five-point lead. Love throws a three. And throws six-minute mark here in the first half. No field goals the last three minutes for Wisconsin. Meanwhile, Arizona four for its last five. Pella Larson go under and 20 bucks in a cab to get around Umar Bala. Love with the strip, soars to the rim, slams it. Well missed it. Wall couldn't get the tip in. Here comes Arizona again. 10-2 run. Love the alley-oop to Ballo for the block. And take a look at this open side pick and roll here in transition. Johnson is not generally a transition team, so they're willing to take the risk. Just one offensive rebound, but that's because the ball's going in the basket. Love banks it in along for Wisconsin. See, that's where guards have to let the big guys have that rebound. <laughs> that belongs to the big guys. That was a mistake by Caleb Love. Ballo inside, banks it in. Nice feed from Larson. Hepburn gets into the lane. 
Ball gets deep in the paint, may have traveled, doesn't matter, swatted away by Bala. Wisconsin, this is the team that gets back and gets their defense established, but on a block shot, you have three guys under the basket, advantage situation right away. And give credit to Pella Larson for getting down the floor quickly and providing that up. Would be Michigan State, Wisconsin, and Purdue all in a row. They can claim they're Big Ten champions. <laughs> They'll be in the Big 12, of course, next year. In that opening stanza, had just one basket, misses again. A ton of body bumping in the low post, but both were initiating it. Difficult to call. Love with the bank shot. Hepburn coming around that crawl screen. Store gets past Larson and gets met at the rim by Ballo, who sends it back. Store took this ball so hard to the basket, took it up to dunk, and Ballo just a rail. This is an outstanding basketball team that is worthy of the number one ranking, but this margin is a surprise. And the dunk by Johnson off the missed free throw. Trevor played at Minnesota in their final four team in, what, 1997. He played for Clint Haskins. It was a really tough player. Three threes now for Nolan Leonard. Ballo got free underneath. Four, and Wisconsin switched it. And Boswell just attacked Winter off of that. Great cut and great drive. Oh, he goes after it. He's a gamer. Grievous tried to get position down low, was poked back out to Johnson. And he switches home a three. Trying to throw the ball up, but it got knocked right back out to Keyshawn Johnson, and he was ready to shoot it. Corner three for Nilver. Won't fall. Balls with pass. Larson gets the basket plus a five. Ricky Foyce in his third year with the Wildcats. Larson driving and scoring with the left hand on the right side of the rim. And this game was tied about seven minutes to go in the first half, and Arizona blew it open. Boswell, another great one. He finds KJ Lewis for the score. He leads Arizona in three point shooting and steals, but he's going to lead him in a. Seven assists actually now for Boswell. Averages about four per game. You can really tell towards the end of last oh. year. Oh! AJ Lewis, just a gorgeous. For the most part, the three's been taken away. But your point on Boswell, last year he was injured for most of the season. He'll, they'll get anything they want. And rolls to the basket. Good luck trying to stop him. Love gets downhill and spins it up and in. But just how improved the defense is. They had the firepower offensively last year. Nice pass that time by Klesman at the alley oop to Crowell. Great job by Boswell to chase Chucky Hepburn over the top of those screens. That's the only only shot he can really get over the uh, two. Love serves it up there beautifully for the Paulo finish. Made the catch and then Storr runs right into Ballo. He just rolls right to the basket. Crowell can't pick him up. Does he stay on the ball or does he go back and get him to do everything? Orowskis' three gives Arizona its largest lead at 31. Blackwell comes back and drill. Martinez on the floor now for Arizona. Get a chance to play here in the final two minutes. Makes a nice cut and gets the basket. Lewis with the pass. Final seconds here in Tucson. Well, if you had not watched Arizona this year, hard to not walk away feeling like they're the best team in college basketball. They score almost 100 in this game, and their defense was just phenomenal from the jump. It's a blowout win for the Wildcats.